everyone and welcome to TSDIY. Today we're going to be creating a decorative lampshade using the materials shown here. Uh, so this particular project cost me about $23 but um, in reality if you do have some of these materials at home this should cost you significantly less. So the materials that we'll need is a lampshade. We'll also need a needle that can accommodate the size of the yarn. Here I have a doll needle but you can use a knitting needle or any other sort of needle that can get the job done. Um, we'll also need some tape, a stencil, and lastly, some yarn. So our first step for this DIY is basically to punch out uh, the design um, out of the, the stencil. Once you have that done, just kind of place the stencil aside. Next, we're going to go ahead and thread our, our needle. So the best way that I found to do this is actually to apply some tape to the edge or to the end of the thread. This kind of makes the whole threading process a lot easier. So once you have that done, just kind of set that aside. Next, we're going to go ahead and take that stencil that you punched out, and now we're going to secure it to our lampshade. So the best method that I found to do this is actually just applying some tape to the perimeter of the stencil. Now, um, you know, the amount of tape that you use will kind of vary based upon the material of the lampshade. Some materials, um, you know, the tape will adhere better to, others it won't. So, you know, it may require a little bit of finessing on your part. Once you have the stencil secure or adhered to the lampshade, our next step is basically to sew in the pattern of our, our stencil into the lampshade. So once you're done with that, just remove the stencil, and voila, there we have it. So that concludes the DIY. So as you can see here, uh, the stencil or the design um, of the stencil really kind of came through on the lampshade, which was our goal. Um, so if you have any questions, as well as if you have any recommendations on how to improve upon this project, please comment below. Um, I'm pretty sure um, all the viewers who are watching this video will find that helpful. So thank you once again for watching this video and please stay tuned for other great DIYs. So have a great day and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.